Look Ahead Control is a demonstrator project together with Scania that aims at reduced fuel consumption in driving. Thanks to new communication technology like GPS, it's possible for a vehicle to know where it is, and therefore it's possible for it to automatically plan uphill and downhill driving. The optimization problem that we are facing are challenging to solve in real time. And what we have done is to devise an optimal control algorithm that allows us to do experimental evaluation on board in a real environment. We are therefore able to find the best possible strategy and to evaluate the potential benefits of it. Look ahead control differs from conventional cruise control, for example, near significant downhills and uphills where the head control may slow down or gain speed prior to the hill. And the strategies to achieve fuel reductions are often that intuitive, but that's only in a qualitative manner. This project has been a collaboration between Scania and Linköping University. We have developed a track demonstrator. We have used a tractor and semi-trailer that weighs about 40 tons. We have used an engine with 310 horsepower that is a five-cylinder, nine-liter engine. We have made experiments by comparing the uh, conventional cruise control to our optimal look-ahead control. And we have shown significant fuel consumption reductions. The look-ahead control has also been perceived as comfortable and natural by the people that have been participating in the test runs. Well, the in förut för slöpor, men också in för upp för spackor känns eh, känns väldigt bra. Och det här är precis det som jag vill göra som förare. Men jag orkar inte riktigt med det. Systemet hjälper mig att att göra rätt varje gång. The algorithm receives information about the current position with aid of the GPS. This information in the form of coordinates from the GPS receiver are matched against a road topography database. Thereby, the algorithm acquires knowledge about the road slope ahead of the vehicle. The algorithm then senses the current velocity and gear and calculates the most energy efficient control with respect to the upcoming topography. By finding the optimal solution, we can quantify the characteristics of the best possible strategy. And because uh, the crucial issue is really the detailed shape of the solution and its actuation, such that a positive end result is obtained. And that is shown to be handled well by the algorithm. 